Anyway, uh, move that microphone a little closer there to you. Carol is with us from the Artesia Senior Center, and glad that the wind is not blowing today. Today is going to be a beautiful day. I think the whole weekend, isn't it? It is going to be gorgeous, so if you're going to see the Yucca Blossom Show or the Car Show or... Tim Tebow or the softball, you know, Carlsbad's coming to play softball tonight, and Gallup's coming to town on Saturday. Uh, and I hope I'm going out of town, but I doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it's going to be a perfect weekend, uh, weather-wise anyway. So Good deal. Well, a new month and a new calendar and a, uh, all kinds of new. Well, we got to finish up this month. We're going to wrap it up with a New Mexico low-income tax rebate. We had a gentleman come in this morning wanting his regular taxes done <laughs> or information on it. Mm -hmm. So just to remind everybody, we have today and two more, and that's it. Okay. For your low-income tax rebate. And, Jane, I wanted to explain a little bit to you. We give the form to the people that's been filled out plus a copy an envelope with a label on it and it's their responsibility to mail it so recently we found out somebody thought even though we gave them all that that we mailed it anyway mm -mm. and was kind of concerned you know they hadn't received it and we we figured it out because in the past we had done that so it's for those that have used us in the past to do that it's a little confusing for them. Sure. So make sure you put your original in that envelope, mail it, and we tell them that. But it's a lot. You know, you're kind of overwhelmed when you're getting handed all this stuff, and there's three or four people there with you. So yeah. anytime they have questions, they'll come back in, and we'll make sure we can get anything cleared up. We can get cleared up. So they'll be there today? Today from 9 to 11. And then the next two the Thursdays. The next two Thursdays, and then we're done. Okay. So, and remember, you can go back three years. If you didn't do yours during that COVID year, bring your information, and we will help see what we can get for you. Okay. So, hope to see several of you down there today. Um, the other thing I wanted to talk about is yesterday it was brought up to me to possibly have a bridge tournament. Oh, a tournament. A tournament, oh. which would be fun. But I don't want to try to do it if we don't have enough interest. Okay. So, if you're interested in a bridge tournament, please contact the Senior Center, 575-748-1207. Mm -hmm. If you don't know that number, come down to the KSVP station, and they'll give you a calendar. That's right. We've got it right here. Uh-huh. Um and so those people that are interested in playing in a bridge tournament, I think it would be a fun challenge. Mm -hmm. I had the opportunity to play bridge with them yesterday, and I learned how to eloquently say pass. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I never got. I called it my nickel hand. My cards, I didn't have any points. Pass. My poor partners, because we trade partners uh -huh. in the next one. Pass. Pass. <laughs> You're not going to get in trouble. <laughs> well, because if I bid with three points and then I have to lay it down and they see it, then I'm busted. Oh, no. So yeah. I, well, I, I noticed on the inside of the newsletter, because I have to be honest with you, I see the calendar part and I see the birthdays part. Uh -huh. But there's all kinds of neat info on the inside. You've got a recipe of the month. You've got uh, hints. Um, you've got the schedule for, like, the transportation schedule and other information like that. So there's a lot of... Um, valuable information that you have on the inside of the flyer. And if you've been watching, Mary is doing an excellent job. What she's doing is rearranging it and kind of putting it in a different format each month so that your eyes don't go exactly to the same thing. Use eyes. How's that? My yeah. English teacher is going to appreciate that. <laughs> use eyes. Use, use eyes. Use. <laughs> Sounds like my... My Use guys. Kindergartner, <laughs> grand, great grandson. Um, but this way you kind of get to look around and see the different things. She has really cute icons. Um, and like you said, there's hints. Mm -hmm. Remove crayon marks from wall with baking soda. Mm, didn't know that. I didn't know that either. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. I like the one when you run your dryer, when you run out of dryer sheets, use aluminum foil. I had no idea that that, w how does that help? We got it off, you know, the wonderful net, the yeah. internet, so it has to be gospel, right? That's right. That's right. So ta I tell people, take the time to take this calendar, 
get you a glass of tea, cup of coffee, juice, whatever is your thing. Sit down and just read it from cover to cover. That's right. You will enjoy it. You will see things. And it, it's kind of grouped where it's not all together, but each uh, activity is grouped in one. So That's right. And your recipe of the month, chicken fettuccine alfredo with veggies. Now, do these uh, come from some of the... Some of your folks. Some there? of them are from the seniors. Yeah. Some of them are from. We get some books that are donated, and a senior will say, "Oh, this is a really good one." Mm -hmm. So we use that. One month we used our dispatcher Cindy's mother's recipe, on a particular. I was trying to think what it was today, but we used her recipe. Yeah. Um, and they're fun. I sometimes try to try them, and then this one I I can't do bottled Alfredo sauce. Ah. That's not my preference. Okay. So I just was like, mm, that sounds good, but I'm not trying that one. <laughs> <laughs> but there's always, there, uh, there will be one that will pop in that you will be happy to try, I'm there sure. There will be, we've had some really good cookie recipes, cake recipes. I like the three ingredient recipes. That's my kind of cooking. <laughs> <laughs> three ingredient recipes. Yes, okay. three we, ingredients. All right. We've got so, about a minute left. Anything yes. else we want to cover today? We're going to talk about across the top, and I'm not going to say what it is, so you got to get your newsletters out and read it. Okay. It's our normal, it's on the opposite of the birthday parties. Okay. It tells you what we're doing for the week. And again, I cannot stress enough for those that have turned 50 and need something to do, we have it. If we're not doing what you'd like to do, the only thing I couldn't accommodate was pickleball. Mm. So everything else we're trying. So I want you to get that. Come out to see us. Um, don't forget, low income tax rebate because people are going to run out of time. Yep. And then they're not going to get it done. Um, come down to KSVP Radio. You pick just brought your, me a whole stack of flyers. Pick so. up your newsletter. Got them, got them right here for folks. Yes. All right, Carol. Well, thank you so much. Do I have 10 seconds? Yes, you do. What do you have? Here we go. I just had it. Okay. Now I'm losing my seconds. The more you take out, the more you leave behind. What are they? The more you take out, the more you leave behind. Oh, I'm sorry. The more you take, the, the mo more you leave behind. The more you what take, are they? The more, the, what are they? Oh, we're over. Minutes. Footsteps. Footsteps. Thanks for having me. All right. Thanks, Carol. We'll be back on the other side of the news.